friends, welcome to Chapel Time with Miss April. Let's light our candle and get started. Last week, we talked about a baby named Samuel. Remember his mother, Hannah, wanted a baby so much and she prayed for one and God gave her baby Samuel. Well, in today's story, Samuel has grown up and he has gone to work in the church with a priest named Eli. Well, one night, when my friend Samuel went to bed, he woke up because he heard someone going, Samuel, Samuel. So Samuel got up and went running to Eli and said, yes, Lord, what do you need? And Eli said, it wasn't me who called you. Go back to bed. So Samuel went back to bed. And again, he heard someone go, Samuel, Samuel. And he got up. And he went to Eli, he goes, yes, do you need me, sir? And Eli said, go back to bed. So Samuel went back to bed. And as he's laying there, he heard his name called a third time. Samuel, Samuel. And Samuel goes, yes, master, what do you need? And this time Eli used his brain and said, ah, it's not me who's calling you, it's God. He said, the next time he calls you, Go, yes, Lord, what do you need? So my friend Samuel went back to bed, and it wasn't long before he heard someone say, Samuel, Samuel. And he got up and he said, yes, Lord, what do you need? And God calls us the same way. When we least expect it, he might want us to be a friend with somebody, or he might want us to give something to somebody. But remember, who loves you? God loves you. Who's always with you? God. And who made you? God made you. And you know what? Sometimes God will call you. Let us sing Jesus Loves Me. You ready? Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. A giant kiss. Mwah! Say goodbye, Samuel. <laughs>